हेलो एवरी वन सो नाउ वी विल लर्न अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग कंसेप्ट दैट इज एम वी सी मॉडल व्यू एंड कंट्रोलर ओके एम वी सी इज अ वेरी फेमस एंड वाइडली यूज डिजाइन पैटर्न इन द ओवरऑल सॉफ्टवेयर डेवलपमेंट सो वॉट इज डिजाइन पैटर्न डिजाइन पैटर्न इज नथिंग बट अ सेट ऑफ रूल्स विच आर डिफाइंड बाय ऑर्गेनाइजेशन और अ डेवलपर फॉर बिल्डिंग अ स्केलेबल फ्लेक्सिबल एंड इंडिपेंडेंट कोड आर्किटेक्चर ओके सिंपली अंडरस्टैंड दैट डिजाइन पैटर्न इज समथिंग देर इज सम सेट ऑफ रूल्स दैट विल बी फॉलोड बाय एंटायर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंटायर ग्रुप ऑफ डेवलपर्स और एंटायर टीम ऑफ डेवलपर्स टू अचीव द स्केलेबिलिटी द फ्लेक्सिबिलिटी एंड द इंडिपेंडेंस इन द कोड आर्किटेक्चर ओके दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इफ यू आर बिल्डिंग अ ह्यूज प्रोजेक्ट्स लाइक जी टी ए असेसन स्क्रेड स्पार क्राई ऑल द ट्रिपल ए काइंड ऑफ कंपनीज और एनी नॉट ओनली ट्रिपल ए एनी ह्यूज प्रोजेक्ट विल डेफिनेटली गोन रिक्वायर्ड अ स्ट्रॉन्ग बेस ऑफ कोड आर्किटेक्चर एंड दिस इज वेयर कम्स इन टू पिक्चर द डिजाइन पैटर्न एंड देर आर बंच ऑफ डिजाइन पैटर्न लाइक ऑब्जर्वर पैटर्न सिंगलटन all our other design patterns will be covered in the full stack game development program so if you are interested to learn all the design patterns and want to learn more about code architectures do check out the full stack game development program so but today uh, in the in the focus of this trial program in the outscale we will be only uh, learning the mvc that is model view controller i will be quickly explaining you what is model view controller i hope you can see my screen so these these are nothing but the set of three scripts okay just like we created one single script uh, in the last video there will be a set of three different scripts here you can see model view controller design pattern one is controller another is model and another is view so what it means is this diagram will show you exact uh, details about the design pattern under the controller i have written controller handles business logic so what is business logic suppose uh, suppose you want to create a logic of a enemy where you want to attack when players enter into some direction suppose player is near to you and you want to attack so that is nothing but a logic right suppose player is near to you attack suppose player is attacking you then do defense suppose player is running away then enemy have to chase so all these logical decisions all these logical parts will be written under the controller okay make sure that uh, controller will only handling uh, business logic then comes model model is nothing but data model takes care of data what i mean by that is suppose uh, i have a player okay i have a player script and inside that there can be tons of things which are totally and purely a data very good examples of data is health what will be the health of my player 100 1000 5000 whatever that number is that number is nothing but a data uh, another example of data is xp level difficulty uh, or level number whatever it can be uh, all related all data related terms will be handled or will be written inside model and then comes view view is something which is responsible for ui and visual things uh, what i mean by visual thing is Uh, suppose you want to have some effects vfx uh, or suppose you want to show some pop up like hey you won the level uh, hey you you completed the level you died or whatever it can be in the ui or in the visual format all these responsibilities will taken uh, or will be fulfilled by the view so this is something also called as single responsibility principle so if you closely observe controller has a dedicated responsibility of handling business logic model has a dedicated single responsibility of handling data and view has a single uh, dedicated responsibility to take care of ui and visual things so this is also very important principle when you are building a large scale projects uh, this is this will help you to fixing the bugs in a proper and efficient way so suppose you are finding a bug uh in a logic then you are 100% and super clear that okay there is a some there is some issue there is some bug inside logic then i will be checking the controller script only okay there is some issue inside a data then i i am 100% sure i need to debug the script of the model so this is how it will help you to organize your entire architecture in a proper scripts and 
that will help you a lot while bug fixing. So this is how the model view controller design pattern will look like. Uh, in Unity, view is nothing but a mono behavior. What is mono behavior? If you have observed, we have created one script and after that there is written something called as mono behavior. Mon mono behavior is nothing but Unity specific class that is provided by Unity. Uh, and there are helpful functionalities. There are some helpful details given by Unity itself for the game development. That is nothing but a mono behavior class that we are using for a game development inside Unity. So this view is nothing but a mono behavior class that will handle all Unity related functionalities like start and update. Like we saw in the previous uh, video, there, there are two Unity defined methods functions. Uh, so all these Unity defined Unity specific functionalities will come under view only and there will be uh, there will be a logic written inside controller and there will be a data written inside model. So this is how entire code architecture will logically look like will fundamentally look like anyways we, we are going to implement this entire MVC for our tank and we will be uh, we will be moving our tank uh, and we will be giving some attributes, some data attributes like health, uh, like attack, like damage and all the things to our tank. And we will going to quickly cover the implementation, the actual implementation of the model view controller in the upcoming videos. Uh, so yeah, thanks about, uh, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, see you in the next video.